Week 1 page tutorials step by step. Hello guys, Ilya here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily create one page website on Wix website builder. So here we are on Wix.com, let's click on get started. It's not that hard to create a website with Wix. All we need to do is just to create an account. I'll continue with Gmail as for me this is the easiest variant. And then all we need to do is just to click on create new site right up here. So let's click. And now we need to answer for some of the questions. So the first question is like, what kind of website are you creating? We're going to create one pager. So basically the category looks like this. So yeah, one pager here and then just click on next. And the second question is, what's the name of your business? Basically, we can input anything we want. So let it be like site one. I'm going to click on next. And um, what do you want to add to your website? Chat, online store or some other things. I'm going to click on skip in the right bottom corner because we can add every single element a little bit later. So let's click on skip. And here we are. Everything is done. Basically, we can now go to dashboard to start managing our like SEO optimization to find some analytics. But I suggest to click on begin with a template. So it will be easier for us to choose the template first. And the results for one pagers are these templates. So as you can see, we have like blank template here, one page layout. And also there is like some templates with, for example, product landing page, coming soon landing page and so on. So everyone can find something suitable as for us. And if we, we are not able to find, we can easily like use blank template and then just create it by our own. So I'm going to click on this right here. So coming soon landing page. So I'm going to click on view. And as you can see, it looks like this. And moreover, what is interesting is that we can easily switch between different devices and it's available also for mobile phone. It's pretty cool that Wix provides us the opportunity to use like uh, responsive websites. So let's edit this site and we're going to use this template as the main as for us. And in a few seconds, everything will be done. All we need to do now is just to wait for a little until we'll come to editor page where we can start adding our single page website. So it takes maybe five to 10 seconds. All we need to do is just to wait. And here we are on our website. If we'll go to our editor, have a quick tour, we can add different elements, add sections, pages and menu, site design, add apps, my business and media, content manager, all these like buttons. Um, it provides us the opportunity to, to change something, to customize. So firstly, I'm going to go to click on site design and I want to customize site theme. I want to change the color palette and the font pack. So as for me, it's pretty cool that it provides us the opportunity to do this. So I'm going to use this like theme here. Yeah. And also if you go to pages and menu, we can find that we only have one page as we needed to create only a single page website. So yeah, but still we can add different pages if we need to add maybe one more page or something like this. And um, also what do we need to know is that this page contains from different sections. At least here we have like header, this section and footer section. Oh no, it's about section and the footer is right up here. So in order to add something, we can simply click on add section. And as you can see, there are a lot of templates we can easily use. Welcome about team contact promotion services and so on. So if we need to add, for example, contact like area, we can easily do it by simply clicking on right up here. And as you can see, this section was successfully added. So now we can easily move it up, move it down. There are a lot of options we can click and then just change the section background if we need. So I'm going to change the image to find something suitable as for us. So as you can see, this is the way of how can we uh, edit different parts of the website we have. So basically, this is the way of how can we do this. So and every single section contains from different elements. As you can see here, we have like text, this gets subscribers form, 
this text here. So basically in order to manage, we can simply click on it. And as you can see, we can click on edit text. From this page, we can easily find all the properties, themes, fonts, font size, make it bold, italic, change the color. So basically I want to make it maybe something like this. So as you can see, it's pretty easy. And what if we need to add some elements, we can just simply click on plus add element and we can find something which is suitable as for us, text, image, button, strip, the creative and so on. Huge amount of different elements we can easily add. So let's add, for example, button here, for example, this button and it was successfully added. So now we can just simply uh, change the position. We can click on change text and icon. We can change the text of the button, for example, high, maybe let it be like this. Uh, how does it link? What, what, what does it link to? So we can just simply click on this icon and then just choose the place where we'd like to link to non page web address section or anchor top or bottom of page so let it be like top of page for example so basically in this case we can interact with every single element here the same way we can simply change the background color so if you need to make it like green for example we can do it like this if you want to make this text a little bit bigger we can increase the size we can increase the size right up here and it's pretty easy and pretty easy to understand how to interact with this and in order to publish our website to the internet, of course, we have the opportunity, even if you don't have any paid version, we can just simply click on save, save and continue. It may take a little time, depends also on server's capacity. And then just click on publish in the right top corner, right up here, we can click on view site. And now this website is available in the internet. So we can send the link to anybody we need to uh, give this like site to so we have the link right up here If you click on Wix in the left top corner right up here, we can go to dashboard uh, From this page here. We can find a lot of analytics a lot of uh, CEO opportunities to optimize uh, our website, so let's wait until it will be downloaded and I will show you how to do this so basically it's not that hard and as you can see website builder uh, called Wix is pretty like friendly for uh, beginners and I think it's pretty cool because uh, we can easily like start and they are often like uh, provide us the opportunity to start it even for free and the paid plans are not that like expensive as you can see for the single website we can just connect the main we can buy combo plan unlimited or vip the prices are right up here so basically these are the differences so you can try it for free and then just decide is it necessary as for you to buy the paid plan so as you can see i can't upload my dashboard i don't know why so yeah this looks like this so we can manage marketing in ceo here analytics and reports right up here so that's all for this video hope this video helped you out please leave a like comment and subscribe i wish you a very good day goodbye